Freedom, how's it going? My name is Adam Maripos Vox and I'm back with another video to tell you about a minor update that YouTube has actually introduced that I just noticed this morning. And that is that they've added visualization for your different monetization formats. This means when you're editing a video and telling it what kind of ads you want to show on the video, usually you just had a bunch of checkboxes, display ads, overlay ads, skippable ads, etc. And for some, this was very, you know, kind of difficult to understand. And that's pretty understandable because they never directly in this section told you what those ads meant. Now with the non-skippable ads, they told you that, hey, if you do long non-skippable ads, people may not watch your video. But now they have visualization for this to help you figure out what you want to do. So they have a box to show where the display ads are, where the overlay ads are. They have a skip button for the skippable ads and then they show something different for the non-skippable ones, which is pretty cool. This makes it so much easier to understand which ad formats you're using. Not only that, but then for your pre and post roll ads, which means your ads that are shown before and after your video, and then your mid roll ads, which for longer videos are shown in the middle of your videos at certain points, they actually have a whole new player for this. It's actually like a timeline and you can check whether or not you want an ad before or after your video. And then it actually has a, an entire timeline of your video and a preview and you can play your video and choose where you want your ads to go. This is so much easier. In the past, you had to just put in time codes. So if you had a 30 minute video, you just had to guess and be like, okay, I want to add 15 minutes in the video. You never really had a way of knowing where that was unless you had another copy of your video pulled up and you were watching that and putting in the numbers. With this, you have an actual preview where you can skip to where you want an ad. So if you, you know, if you want to wait till somebody stops talking, which is what I just did, you can actually, you know, play back the video and get it exactly where you want it and put in the ads on that timeline. Makes it a lot easier. Over on the advanced tab, they actually have a couple changes as well to the comments. Uh, used to, you just had to allow comments or allow people to see your ratings. Well, now you can allow comments and you can actually tell it whether or not you want it to automatically sort by the top comments, which are the ones that got the most attention, had the most likes on it, etc., or by newest first. So if you don't want the top comments to be ruling your video, you can actually tell it to put newest first. That way everybody always just sees the newest comments at the top. Pretty cool. You didn't have control over this before. That was completely up to the person and the person, you know, the viewer may not ever actually change that drop down box. So it's really cool to see. Hopefully they'll be adding some other more useful things like this as the visualization of the other uh, of the ad types is actually very nice. Just wanted to let you know about this quick update to YouTube. If there's anything else, I'm sure you'll be seeing other videos on this channel about it as well. Just wanted to get this information out to you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to smash that like button if you liked it. Dislike the video if you want to see me cry at night over on my channel. Subscribe to Freedom Central if you're somehow not already. Come check out my channel over at YouTube slash EposVox. And I'll catch you in the next one. Hopefully we got some other cool content coming up here on Freedom Central for you as well. Also, if you didn't notice, George is back. He was actually in a video again recently for the first time in forever. So go check out that video in the YouTube card or the end card, something on the screen here. Do the Macarena. Okay, bye.